Hi everyone, welcome back to Danielle's Decor. Today I wanted to show you guys what I decided to do with that little bar that I bought from Ikea. Um, I do not know how it's pronounced, but it's just a little black metal bar. I decided, I looked all over my kitchen and was thinking where can I put, I wanted to do two of them, you know, one on top of the other. And really I didn't have space for it. And the only place that I could figure out to do it would be on the wall where my big round clock is, which is kind of up over there. I'll point to it. <laughs> would be over there. And truthfully, I didn't want to take my clock down. I don't have no other place to move it. So I didn't want to do that over there. So what I decided to do was put it right here on the end of my island. So this side right here has a lip that kind of sticks out. So anything that's hung on this island won't stick out to where you'll bump it when you come through because the counter, you know, kind of comes out to cover it. The other side on the other end is flush. So it, I couldn't do it over there. And it's kind of narrow on that end of the island anyway. But I decided to go ahead and do it right here. And over, over that way <laughs> is the living room. So when you walk into the living room and the kitchen, you'll see it right here on the end of the island. And I thought it was really pretty. So let me go ahead and kind of shift you guys around so you can see. I got stuff sitting down here all over the floor. And it's really dark in this area. So I had to bring in a light to kind of go back behind the camera so you guys could see what I was doing. Okay. As you can see, <laughs> I hung some little chili peppers and I tied them on with just a little piece of uh, twine, but you'll see why I got them hanging there. I didn't want to have to take them back off and I did kind of play with this a little bit so that I knew what exactly where and how I wanted to do. <laughs> um, I took a couple of my kitchen towels that are actually my everyday towels that I use. I have a couple. I have one like this and then one kind of like that and the shadows from this light is atrocious but anyway so these are from Sam's Club and they're just the little members mark towels but this one I wanted to hang right here on the end oh, fighting shadows and camera angles hopefully this will work a little bit better all right, so we're gonna start. I have my five little hooks that I bought to go with this. And then I'm gonna take my little towel. And these towels have the little things, loop things on them where you can hang them. So I'm gonna hang this one, if I can get it down here on the end like that. Let me kind of pull you guys. Hopefully you guys can see all this. And then, I have my other little towel that I'm gonna want to go over top like this. I wanna make sure that it stays folded. I don't like it when my ends flare out. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna hang that one right there. Now, the little things that I bought to go in there, like this, if I hang them off the hooks the way that they're supposed to go, it's too high and I didn't like it. So I took just a little piece of twine like that and I just ran it through there. That way this would hang down a little bit lower to where I wanted it. And then I have just my little ball of greenery or my little greenery pick that I'm gonna set down in here. And then I have my little wooden spoons like this. And I actually stole a couple things off my counter over there to use on this, but we're gonna change all that here soon anyway. But, and honestly, for fall, I'm gonna change this up again and, and do more fall stuff, so. This is just kind of to go with my summer decor. So this is what I have so far. And then over here on this end, I'm gonna use one of my little cutting boards. And that's actually going to go right here. 
like that. I'll hang it on those two. I don't remember if I want that. Nope, that. Let's get this out of the way. And then on this one, I have my chalkboard cutting board. And I did um, take my chalk marker and I just wrote welcome and I drew a little flower. Just kind of doodled and played around. It's not perfect, but it is what it is. I didn't break out my Cricut and do a little thing. I was just kind of playing with it by hand. So, I want my little peppers. I like the little peppers because it gives it just a little tiny pop of color. You know, because that's all kind of neutral things. And I think that's all I'm going to do to it. I want my, you know, cutting boards to kind of be stacked. But other than that, let me slide that back that way. That's all I'm going to do. So. But I will take the camera down and show you guys, you know, a little bit better. Hopefully I can get some better lighting going on. <laughs> it's dark and dreary. We've had rain for the past three days and y'all my hair is just back to frizzy fuzzy again. <laughs> but I just wanted to do this quick little video to show you what I decided to do with this. The other rod, I don't know where I'm going to use it just yet. I might find a place for it. I was thinking about putting it in my bathroom actually and doing something different in there, but we'll see. I kind of want a shelf to go over. I got all these ideas in my head. <laughs> I want a shelf with the little sides and then I want my rod in the middle and yeah so <laughs> we'll see how how that turns out and I'll show you if I decide to do it and when we decide to do it I might have to have my husband make me a shelf so we'll see well, let me pull my camera down and I'll show you guys this up close a little bit more and I'll be right back okay guys as you can see there's the end of my kitchen island so this sits right underneath of it and you can see <laughs> It's atrocious underneath the edge of it right there, but I did paint this island. It was that funky red color, and you can still kind of see a little bit of it up underneath there. But when you're standing up, you don't see it. So if you crawl around on my floor, you might see little bits of red <laughs> under my counters. So <laughs> not that you would be crawling around on my floor, but anyway, I just thought this was really cute like that. Kind of show you guys a little bit closer, my little chalkboard thing. And as you can tell, it's not perfect. I'm not an artist by no means, but. <laughs> so, and then the little peppers just kind of, and it ties in with the summer market that I have going right now. I haven't taken any of that down. I will shortly, but for right now, I really want to, I love it. So I'm going to keep enjoying it until we get ready to do fall. <laughs> Well, that's all I have for you guys today. I'm gonna kind of pan back and step in here into the the living room so that you can kind of see when you're standing in here and walking into the kitchen, you see it hanging there. I just think it's pretty, adds a little something extra. Gives me another little space to decorate in my kitchen like I need more decor around here. <laughs> but that is all I have for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching, bye.